four-month-old Chikumbi was found wandering alone. After losing her mother, she tried to join another herd, but they didn't accept her. Now she has a second chance to join another very special herd. The orphan herd, each member with a tragic history, but fortunate enough to find a new family. Her siblings smell her intently. She then backs into Chip, a respectful gesture, along with a couple of nervous self-touching behaviors. Chip is very interested. She's a bit nervous when approaching Deliso, but bravely reaches for his branch. She calmly considers her movements and doesn't feel the need to rush to the keepers for support. But if they're nearby, she does accept brief reassurances. Mabilla touches and smells her, a young matriarch in training. She very slowly rubs her head along her body and gently reaches her trunk towards her mouth. But Mabilla is also interested in the food Chikumbi has. Wanwai is curious about this newcomer. He enjoys a certain amount of privilege and attention being the baby of the herd, especially from matriarch Limba. Is Chikumbi a threat to this? She's a little nervous and for good reason. Wam decides to give her a little push and then a barge. Wam doesn't need to be worried. Alimba is curiously disinterested in this introduction. Oldest male Chip again is very curious about her and she even moves closer to him. Chikumbi is relaxed enough to feed and this is a relatively calm intro. Wam approaches and puts his trunk in her mouth, a bonding behavior, perhaps a sorry for his previous actions. She turns her rear towards him in submission. Every orphan is unique, bringing with them their own experiences, personalities and levels of trauma. So every introduction is slightly different, but for everyone it's a huge step in their journey back to the wild.